Good morning. Welcome back to Soul Study Sunday. Today we have a guest star, Matthew Fry, with us. studying um, worldwide religions, three specifically. Can you tell me a little bit about it? Yeah, actually I can. The religions I study are Christianity, Judaism, and Islam. Judaism was formed in 2000 BC by Abraham in Jerusalem. Their symbol is David's star. Their holy book is called the Torah. It is similar to the Bible because of the Ten Commandments. They are the first monotheistic religion in the world. This means they only believe in one God called the God. LOL. The Torah gives information on the life of the Jewish people and their history. Now, some of their famous holidays are the Passover, Hanukkah, and Yom Kippur. That was really well explained about how you explain Judaism to the Islam. Now, can you tell me a little bit about Christianity? Now, it was founded in Palestine, and it was founded by Jesus. The funny thing is that Jesus was actually Jewish, but he believed, he believes in caring for people and nursing for young ones. And what are the followers of Christianity called? They're called Christians, and they worship in a church. They pray to their God and turn away from their sins. And um, who do they worship? They worship God, and they're only one God. They're a monotheistic religion. And are they the biggest monotheistic religion? Actually, yes, they are. They wow, nearly have two, I didn't know that. They nearly have two billion members. Wow. Do you know anything else that's interesting about Christianity? Well, on Christmas... Jesus was born, and like merchants saw the David's saw a star, actually, just a star, and they believed that to be a good sign, so they followed it, and that's where the tradition of gift-giving came. And what are some other really famous holidays in Christianity? Another famous holiday is Easter. It shows how when Jesus was chosen on the cross, and... Resurrected. On, and yes, and he was resurrected on Good Friday and something Saturday. <laughs> um, and do you know any other holidays? Um, no, you, they do celebrate Halloween. Okay, so not really about religion. Yeah. Well, that was really good. Dude, stop the thing now. <laughs> well, our guest are Matthew's last world is going to talk about is Islam. Now, Islam was founded in the city of Mecca during the Arabian Empire time. It was founded during the early BC hundreds. Now, interesting that in, Arab in Arabian, um, Allah, they're, they're what they call their god, means the god. <laughs> That's interesting. Um, what do you call the followers of Islam? They're called Muslims, not Muslims, Muslims. I would think that they would be called Islams, because they're Christian, Jews. Well, are Jews called Judisms? Good point. <laughs> and where do they worship? They worship in a mosque. And what's their holy text? Their holy text is called the Quran. And what are some of their holidays? Well, during they make a pimage to the to the city of thank you, sorry to the city of Mecca, mm -hmm. and that is when they they do that once in a lifetime to show and to talk with God and show their respect and do the things they need to do. And during that festival. They're dressed in white clothing, traditional white clothing. Are there any more um, celebrations or traditions they have? Well, they fast a lot. Fasting is so they, from sun, from sunset to sundown. Sunrise. To sunset. Sunset. <laughs> sunrise to sunset. They fast and think about, are they truly following God's rules? And what do you do while you're fasting? Or what do you don't do? You don't eat. <laughs> <laughs> I love eating. Okay. And this is usually started at the age of 12 because smaller ages cannot stand. <sighs> Thank you, Matthew. So good having you on the show. See you See next time. time. Bye. See you guys next time. We'll see you Sunday.